Hello, Nico2064 here, back with another video. And today I'm going to make Kaecilius from Doctor Strange. Um, because he was one we did not get. And I got a request for this one in the comments of the last video. Um, so yeah, let's get into this. The legs have to be the, uh, <laughs> hardest part to, um, actually make. Because I took, um, a yellow leg off of, like, some underpants or something. <laughs> you know, one of those leg pieces. Uh, and then the legs from the janitor in series 15. I took the right leg off and put it on here. Um, I know I usually don't do that much, like, um, customization on legs. Um, but I think it works here because he has a, like, kind of, um, mixed up look on his suit. And any of the parts, uh, that aren't gold on him, that are yellow, are supposed to be gold. So I guess you could use a gold leg, but I think it matches the arms. Uh, and the arms are from the janitor. The hands and the torso are from King Tut from the Batman series one. Uh, and you could probably find a good torso. I just thought this one was kind of nice. But you could use like Snoke's torso from Star Wars or the Grandmaster's torso from Ragnarok or something. Uh, now, just use a male Incredibles face. Uh, cause in the movie he has like, like, I don't know exactly what spell or whatever he used to get the Dormammu ooze on his eyes. Sorry, I haven't seen Doctor Strange in a little bit. But, you know, his eyes, uh, look like this. This is the one from the minifigure series, the Disney series. Uh, just because I like the kind of evil expression, almost. Uh, the hair is, comes on a few characters. I think... I don't remember, I just took this one out of my sorting bin, but it comes on the Grandmaster and, um, what's the, the villain's name in the first Jurassic World, um, is who I took the hairpiece off of, I think that's where he came from, uh, now, I don't expect you to have this accessory, uh, it's just a little, um, paper, the Dormammu symbol on it, uh, from the Sanctum Sanctorum, uh, slash Peter Parker's apartment from Infinity War, um, so that's a good accessory, and then this, uh, like, um, I can't insert clip because of copyright reasons, but he uses this to, like, stab Doctor Strange, uh, or tries to, anyway. Right before Doctor Strange reverses time. Um, so just watch that scene. Tries to get him with it. This is the weapon. Um, and then, I actually took mine from this Ice Queen. Not Elsa. Um, from Series 16. She came with two of those. So I'm sure you can find them. So yeah, here he is. Um, the face, I'm glad I found one. That looks like him. Because you really only can use this face. Um, I guess Dash or um, the newer Mr. Incredible. But the new Mr. Incredible and Dash both have smiles. Like big goofy smiles. Uh, and his is more like a menacing smile, you know. Uh, for the torso, as I said, you can use other torsos. But um, the arms and legs, I just kind of liked um the look of you know and i would have given him like a plain yellow like jacket but i believe they do not exist or at least the kind that are um would like look like the robes he wears in the movie because you know yellow is the skin color of like basic minifigures um that's why the yellow groin piece piece that holds the legs together sand blue part on this one was discontinued um and actually uh this is a little bonus um i have a few 
of these kind of springy ones that you're supposed to launch um, basketball stars on from way back when they did NBA sets. Have a couple of these in yellow. Um, and then also, I have this, which is not too hard to get. Has a few wrinkles, so if you wanted to make a naked fat man, um, you could do it with this. But these came on the Boxer Batman. And now this is the actual authentic one. This came on, like, the Clown Batman. Um, and I actually... A plain yellow groin piece, which just doesn't look right. I mean, from the back especially... I mean, it just looks like I'm naked. But enough with that. Censored, demonetized for um, nudity. And let's just finish this video. Um, so, yeah. Uh, I actually really need help. The next movie is Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 2. I have an idea for one character, but I don't know if I can actually make it. Oh, uh, you're probably already thinking. Uh, hang on, my dog. Go. Okay. Sorry about that. My dog was messing with my green screen. Um, uh, but yeah. I really need help. You're probably already thinking of the character that I would like to make, which wasn't in any of the sets. But if you could think of one, that would be very helpful. Nico2064, signing off. <laughs> Yes, I have a dog who looks like this.